Hello, you scrub. Welcome to an Unicom guide on how to play the tiger, but first, a warning up front. This Unicom guide is also applied to the tiger 131. Yodel, I heard you like tiger, so we put some tigers in your tiger. The tiger is a tier 4 German heavy tank that is not as awesome as the museum piece it was based on. NetEase gave the tiger a historical middle finger and gave it none of the features it had in real life. The penetration is mediocre, the accuracy is not sniper-like, the armor is quite bad. NetEase please, why you do this? Oh yeah that's right, Chinese fucking bias. I forgot, if the tiger was an actor, it would be Bo Giamatti, always playing the supporting role, and rarely the main character, yet you want him on your team, because he is good at support acting. Be like Bo. Support the shit out of your team from mid-range. The armor of the tiger only works on tier 4 and below. Angle it to Sahara like temperature. Tiger tanks like the desert. 30 to 45 degree is good. The accuracy is not too great. Especially in higher tier you won't be able to hit weak spots reliably. Unlike in 1943 on the eastern front. Where every tank is a giant weak spot from 2 kilometers away. Where did the good times go? Luckily your DPM makes up for this, and you can dominate subhuman in tier 3 like a real camp commandant. In order to make this tank sing louder than my leady trick, this is how you select your ammunition. You select the majority of AP to show your power with your 88mm, then a healthy bunch of APCR to show the motherfucker who is Führer, and some AG for extra style. The tiger's mobility is quite okay for a heavy, underlining the importance of keeping up with your team and supporting. However, when you can do well in tier 4 you can carry your own weight and even take down Stalin hand 1 vs 1. Brawling in tier 5 on the other hand is like being Italy in the second world war. You want to, but you cannot, because you suck. To make life bearable, and not to suicide at the end of the war, this is what you select for crew skills. Select repair for the entire crew. When you reach the first skill, select gun improvement skills and view range skills is next. When you reach the second skill, drop for reactive training. And as for third skill, you should go for view range again, since this works good on your high tier heavies. Also if you want to make this tank work, this is what you select for equipment. Because of course NetEase forgot to give the tiger the superior reload it had in real life. Ammo rack for faster reload. V stab for running quick scope and turbo to excel the ability to do some blitzkrieg. This is not the best tank out there, but the premium version can be a good crew trainer for your German heavies. This is how you play the tiger, this is the correct way. Go out there and wait for those games where you are top tier. Thanks for watching you wearables. Why don't you subscribe? Watch other useful thing. See you on the next video. Now thank you and fuck off. Bye.